When you use an IMAP account, you'll have folders called this computer only for your calendar contacts and tasks. These will not sync to your server and they will not sync to a cell phone. If you want these to sync, you will need to add them to an Outlook.com account and that is easy enough to do. Go into File, Add Account, add your Outlook.com account. If you've added the account to Outlook before the password is saved, otherwise it will ask you for the password. Click Done. You'll need to restart Outlook and Outlook will set the um, Outlook.com account as the default data file. If you're not using the folder list, it might be a little easier just so you can see where the folders are. Uh, but you can move the contents from any of the folders. And sometimes you'll have a little oddball like that up. If you're going to move the calendar, you need to change the view to a list view. Then you can select all with con using Control A. And then you can either use right click and move or you can just drag them to the other calendar. And then we do the same thing for the contacts. We go into the contacts, control A to select. Uh, you should be able to do it in any view, but uh, you can use one of the other views. It might be a little easier to see what you've got there. Uh, do a control A to select all. And then you can either drag like I did before or use the right click and move and choose other folders and then contacts. Now we go back to the inbox or back to the mail folder. Right click on the IMAP accounts email address and choose open file location. This will open Windows Explorer to the location where your data file is. Close Outlook and rename the data file. And you can name it anything you want to. I usually name it old. Um, we don't want to erase the name. We just want to add old to the name. I've used this account before to um, change the name. So I'm going to put old2 in there. And now we restart Outlook. This will sync a new Outlook data file down without the this computer only folders. They'll eventually all sync down there. We'll go over to the folder list to see what is there. Now you just need to add your Outlook.com account to your phone or to your other computer and everything will sync. Uh, one thing you probably will want to do uh, in advanced, you want to make sure that this is set to your IMAP account instead of to the Outlook.com account. And you can also drag this up to the top.